The cold won't keep Americans grounded this holiday season. Fox Business Network's Tracy Carrasco takes a look at what to expect before you board in this look at your cash. When I got here, like I saw this line, I was really, you know, worried to to miss the flight. It's a good holiday season for the airlines with a record number of travelers flying for Thanksgiving, more than 30 million. People are voting with their wallets and making choices to fly. That's why more people are flying now than they ever have before. It's gonna take a little while for people to get in and out of the planes, to get things settled in, to get people's bags put in. The TSA says the best way to ensure a quick trip is to arrive early and be prepared. Allow time to park, return rental cars, check bags, and get boarding passes before heading to security. It's a choice that people make. People are choosing to fly because it is so affordable and so accessible. And today you can fly for less money than you can any time in our history. Prices are down 5.5% year over year, 7% since 2010. That includes ancillary fees. If you haven't flown in a while, you'll notice baggage fees are up about $5 for most major airlines. But anyone needing a little extra support before boarding might find therapy dogs roaming some airports for comfort. And you might be able to navigate the sea of travelers with the help of interactive kiosks like these at Houston's Bush Intercontinental Airport. It'll produce a 3D map that shows you step by step where you're going to to get on your gate. TSA says on average it screens more than 2 million passengers and crew every day. Those numbers growing by about 25% over the holidays. We do have security you've got to go through. Uh, People don't like that. But you might like it more with TSA's pre-check. An $85 fee covers you for five years. Your typical wait time is only seven minutes in the regular lane, but it's two minutes in the pre-check lane. Tracy Carrasco, Fox Business.